This is a basic overview of the IOLink configuration software from Banner Engineering. The IOLink configuration software allows you to connect a Banner IOLink master directly to your PC and configure it using a visual user interface. The software allows for two methods of connecting to an IOLink master. A serial connection using the RS-485 to USB converter cable or via an Ethernet connection. For this example, we are connecting via Ethernet. The first step that you will need to perform before connecting to the software is to set the IP address and subnet for the Ethernet connection. The manual for your banner IOLink master will provide step-by-step -step instructions for this process. After configuring your IP address, launch the software and click Connect. Select the Ethernet option and click Scan. A new window will appear that will let you scan for the subnet that you input previously. Click Go, select the IOLink master in the results, click Confirm, and then click Connect again. The General section under the IOLink Masters tab provides identifying information about the master itself. The Port Setup section of this tab enables you to view and edit the settings of all available IOLink ports on the master. Near the top of the screen, there will be an additional tab for each IOLink device connected to the master. If you are connecting a new Banner IOLink compatible device, you will be prompted to search for the IODD file automatically. If you need to load the file manually, download the IODD file from the product or series page on the website and then load it by clicking Load IODD. The software will now be able to properly label each piece of data provided by the device. There are three sections under each device tab, Generic, Process Data, and Parameters. The Generic tab allows you to view and edit all of the data flowing between the master and the device directly using hexadecimal digits. The Process Data section is where you can view all of the data coming into the master from the device, such as measurement and output statuses for a Q4X sensor. This is also where you can send out specific data commands to the attached device, such as changing animation states on a Pro Lighting product. The Parameter section is where you can read and write all of the parameter data that affect the device settings. You will need to click Read Params each time that you connect to the software. The software provides a combination of drop-down menus and text boxes for each parameter, allowing you to configure everything from sensor teach modes to custom colors of lighting products. You can also reset the device to factory settings in this section. Once you have input your chosen parameters, click Write Params to send them to the device. Lastly, you can save your configuration directly to your PC to be loaded later by clicking Save Config. That covers the basics of the IOLink configuration software. For more information, visit BannerEngineering.com.